Hello everyone, um, how are you all doing today? So, blotchy uneven skin tone can be really frustrating to deal with, okay? But the good news is, in this video, I'm going to be telling you five skincare tips that when practiced consistently can help you lighten your skin when i talk about lightening skin i'm not talking about bleaching or changing your the shades of your skin tone i'm talking about achieving even skin tone a brighter complexion a younger looking skin and free of dark spots and hyperpigmentation okay these skincare tips when practice consistently when used consistently can definitely give you an even skin tone that you will love okay more like giving you a glowing radiant skin my channel for the first time my name is Chico Kelly I'm a certified esthetician uh, in this channel I teach skincare so basically everything that's got to do with skincare I teach you how to achieve even skin tone and how to look after your skin so we'll talk about skincare in this channel so if this is your first time Thank you so much for stopping by welcome um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and subscribe so that you more like to keep you up to date on what is happening on my channel okay thank you so much as you do so and for my regular visitors mwah, I love you thank you so much for coming back achieving an even skin tone like I mentioned earlier is something that cannot happen overnight okay and it's something that you have to be consistent you have to develop a regular skincare routine so i'm going to give you five tips in this video five skincare tips that you should do morning and night every single day morning and night some of them you do every day some of them you do like once or twice a week when okay. it comes to radiant glowing skin my beautiful people <laughs> There's no miracle in achieving radiant glowing skin. It's the same thing as everything you want to get in life. You have to put, you know, extra work. You have to put, you have to, you know, prepare yourself, take out your time to look after your skin. So the first skincare tips that I'm going to give you today is cleansing. Okay cleansing is very important a lot of people neglect cleansing and a lot of people do it the wrong way all right cleansing the reason cleansing is very important when it comes to achieving a lighter skin complexion is because our skin takes in a lot of dirt okay and our skin also produces a lot of sebum oil most people produce more most people produce less some people have dry skin some people have sensitive skin but your skin type has nothing to do with cleansing your skin you need to cleanse your skin because when you cleanse it allows your skin to breathe okay it allows your uh, your pores you know to be less open okay and when your skin breathes and when your skin is, um, you know, it's cleansing. So we're more like cleaning all the dirt, all the impurities, all the dead skin uh, cells that are trapped on your skin. So when you cleanse your skin, your, it allows your skin to breathe and it allows you 
to have a proper complexion if you don't cleanse your skin very well you will not achieve even skin tone and you will not achieve a lighter skin tone how many times do you have to cleanse your skin so cleansing has to be done twice a day depending on your skin type okay for those of you that have dry sensitive skin you can just use micellar water in the morning and with cutting wool wipe your face okay but for those of you that have oily skin you need to double cleanse you cleanse using your micellar water and then your cleanser you do the same thing at night okay and when you have a makeup on you need to use your cleansing oil to more like um soften the makeup because let me tell you something most of the breakouts most of the hyperpigmentation most of the dark spots we have is as a result of build up of bacteria and most of those bacteria that build up now on our skin it is as a result of lack of cleansing your skin very well it's not a case of cleansing but you have to cleanse your skin very well you have to learn how to cleanse your skin very well i have this video up here that will show you how to cleanse your skin the right way okay that's the first tip now the second tip is face steaming face steaming when it comes to achieving a lighter complexion face steaming is very important i love face steaming and the reason is because face steaming boosts exfoliation okay face steaming helps to losing any oil any dirt any impurities or acne cause causing bacteria on your skin okay and in turn helps to give you that even skin tone but my favorite part of face steaming is it helps to boost circulation okay because when you boost when your skin when the circulation on your skin is boosted it more like um you know improves collagen oxygen production and when all these cells are improved then it, the result is a younger healthier lighter and radiant looking skin so if it's something that you don't you've not been doing try and introduce face steaming into your skincare routine you face steam people with sensitive skin i'll probably tell you that um, you should avoid face steaming because it can make your skin a little bit more sensitive okay but other skin types you can face steam your 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 skin like two or three times a week it's very very important and when you do that you begin to notice a huge difference in your skin tone okay now the third tip is exfoliation okay you cannot achieve a lighter complexion and even skin tone without exfoliating your skin okay exfoliation is very very crucial the reason is because when you exfoliate your skin it will do a lot it has a lot of advantages okay the first one is exfoliation will help your skin you remove dead skin cells because a lot of acne, the, a lot of acne that we get is as a result of build up of dead skin cells okay the second thing is when you have like dark spots the use of uh, chemical exfoliants okay so when i'm talking about exfoliation i'm, I'm the, the likes of um uh natural dermatological um dermatological uh, treatments like um the alpha hydrose acid which are the pills the acid the pills okay we have the enzyme pills as well we have the beta hydrose acid all these acids will help your skin will help to uh, remove like if you have like sunspots you have like dark spots you have like hyperpigmentation even premature aging signs exfoliation will really help to boost your skin tone and your exfoliation when does consistently and you know how many times you have to exfoliate your skin two to three times a week is the maximum do not go more than that because when you do it too much as well 
it can cause your skin to become overly sensitive which is what you don't like you don't want okay so try and exfoliate your skin as often as you can okay when you exfoliate your skin it will help your skin to achieve even tone and it will help your skin color to brighten and lighten up okay the second exfoliation that i love is the use of face mask okay face masks um face masks is very very good face masks when used with some ingredients like um the face masks that have some ingredients like koji acid vitamin c and e soy um uh, licorice extract those face masks with those kind of those these ingredients that i've mentioned will really really like help to lighten your skin okay so when you're looking for face masks make sure you get face masks with this ingredient that i mentioned make sure at least one or two of these ingredients are in those in the face masks that you're gonna get okay and the same thing you you use face masks after cleansing morning and uh, two or three times a week <laughs> i usually like exfoliating my skin in the evening time because after that then i'm going to bed my skin is resting and it's working much better and i'm not going out in the sun you know putting my skin in another st stress again and pollution and dirt and all that so i, I exfoliate my skin at night. but it's up to you it's up to you is your schedule whatever time that suits you there's no pressure don't put yourself into any pressure when it comes to skincare routine make sure you do it based on the time that suits okay mentioning exfoliation again i do not like scrubs okay avoid scrubs especially for skin of color because too much scrubbing is not good for our skin okay you use the mask or you use the chemical exfoliant it will work much better so avoid my avoid scrub do not use scrub i'm not a fan of scrub facial scrub at all because facial scrub can especially for those with dry skin can really read your skin of natural oil and can make your skin overly sensitive and some people use it really really bad you know like scrubbing as if they are fighting with it with it <laughs> so avoid it if your skin of color not good for you the fourth skincare tip is moisturizing your skin okay moisturizing is very important so when you moisturize your skin it's like giving your skin food okay and especially if you after using all the exfoliant that i mentioned or cleansing your skin you need to moisturize your skin you need to use your serum and you need to use your moisturizer afterwards okay because moisturizers are more like um how do i put it they seal everything everything you have put on your face everything you've done on your skin moisturizer and then will now help you to seal it up to make it last longer penetrate much deeper and give you that lighter even skin tone that you're looking for okay when looking for your moisturizers look for moisturizers that have like niacinamide um and then niacinamide is very good for people that have skin issues like dark spots or hyperpigmentation uh, moisturizers that have ingredients like ceramides ceramides are very good especially for people looking for hydration and fighting premature aging okay vitamin c is very important vitamin c would really really give you that lighter skin um, tone that you're looking for and for people with dry skin you look for oil based moisturizers and people with oily skin you use a lighter based moisturizer okay and make sure whatever skincare product you're buying i say this all the time make sure it suits your skin type and once you do that you're good to go you're on your way to getting a lighter even complexion okay the last but not the least the fifth skincare tip is sunscreen sunscreen is the master of achieving <laughs> even skin tone look sun is a culprit when it comes to damaging our skin okay sun not 
only make your hyperpigmentation or dark spots go darker it also gives you you know premature aging it can damage your skin okay always apply your sunscreen when you're going outdoors protect your skin from the sun okay and when you start putting sunscreen on you will begin to notice your your skincare product will actually work much better well, when you don't do that if you expose your skin to too much sun um it just wouldn't be the results wouldn't really be what you want to see <laughs> okay it won't be what you want to see if you want me to do it this is a requested video though if you want me to do any other topic for you leave a comment below in the comment section i hope you find this video helpful okay and um if you haven't subscribed make sure you subscribe and if you haven't liked this video click the like button and like this video i love you so much my favorite people and i look forward to seeing you in my next video Mwah.